Okay, so let's look at the next term cross talk. What do we understand when we say the term cross talk? Cross talk is a disturbance caused by the electric or magnetic fields of one telecommunication signal affecting a signal in an adjacent circuit. Again, I repeat. Cross talk is a disturbance caused by the electric or magnetic fields of one telecommunication signal of one telecommunication signal of one telecommunication signal all right affecting a signal in an adjacent circuit affecting a signal in an adjacent circuit all right basically this particular signal is impacting this particular signal maybe this particular signal maybe the second one is impacting the third one all right wires affected by the cross talk so basically a cross talk is a disturbance caused by the electric or magnetic fields see understand that you are not supposed to go you know so much in depth into understanding these things because technical part won't be asked in your exam but you know uh, you have this in your syllabus that's why we are discussing about it but again you know they don't ask that much you know uh, like they won't ask that much technical part in exam anyways you know uh, let's finish our discussion cross talk is a disturbance caused by the electric or magnetic fields of one telecommunication signal affecting a signal in an adjacent circuit in electronics cross talk is any phenomena by which a signal transmitted on one circuit or channel a signal transmitted in one circuit or one channel of a transmission creates an undesired effect an undesired effect in another circuit or channel in another circuit or channel this is what cross talk so as you can see in the screen there is a disturbance in a signal the signal is moving like this like this like this like this like this all right and over here there is a you know a disturbance and maybe the, this disturbance is causing a disturbance in the neighbor pair all right so over here also there is a disturbance and over here also there is a disturbance all right so this is what we say when we talk about the term cross talk all right now next concept is the types of cable all right we have you know different different types of cable but understand that you know main bifurcation is between the two copper based cable and fiber optic cable although in copper based cable you know there are so various other things like you know which we will discuss unshielded twisted pair shielded twisted pair coaxial cable but you know all these things come under your copper based wire copper based cables and the second one is the fiber optic cables all right just wait a second before discussing that uh yes fiber optic cable is you know best in respect of everything so if the question comes which of the following is the best option for having a proper security for having less emi for having less attenuation less cross talk no cross talk no attenuation no emi you know best best cable the best cable is always for fiber optics cable all right in terms of everything fiber optics is the best all right as you can see in the uh, you know the difference table fiber optics versus the copper all right uh, if you compare like for everything bandwidth future proof distance noise security handling life cycle weight energy consumed you compare anything fiber optics is always better than the copper based cables all right now under copper based cables you know we have the difference between the unshielded twisted pair 
first of all when we say twisted you know as you can see the wires are twisted all right the wires are twisted so basically under twisted also you know twisted pair is a part of what copper based cable yes under twisted pair there could be utp unshielded twisted pair second is stp shielded twisted pair now as you can see over here this is a shield all right shielded twisted pair and over here there is no shield so basically unshielded there is no shield cover there is no shield cover in case of here but here there is a shield cover i hope you can see just wait a second yes so over here there is a shield all right but over here there is no shield and that's why it is called unshielded it is called unshielded twisted pair and this is called shielded twisted pair all right now shield shielded twisted pair stp is better than the utp unshielded because because of shielding there would be less emi less attenuation all right so shielding shielded twisted pair is better than ha having unshielded twisted pair all right now let's look at the question just wait a second yes uh, before looking at the question again one more thing important now twisted pair cabling twisted pair cabling is a type of wiring in which two conductors of a single circuit are twisted together just wait a second yes i hope you can look at the definition just wait a second Mm, anyways yes twisted pair cabling is a type of wiring in which two conductors of a single circuit are twisted together for the purposes of for the purposes of improving electromagnetic compatibility compared to a single conductor there could be what single conductor there could be you know single conductor or you can say untwisted you can say untwisted cable for example for example this one coaxial coaxial cable you know over here there is no twisting of the wires over here there is no twisting all right but in case of utp and in case of stp obviously the name itself tells you twisted pairs all right so what they are saying compared to a single conductor or an untwisted balanced pair a twisted pair reduces not completely avoid or not completely remove but it just reduces twisting only reduces all right obviously fiber is the best best option see twisting just reduces all right twisted pair reduces just wait a second twisted pair reduces electromagnetic radiation from the pair electromagnetic radiation from the pair and cross talk basically you know having a twisted pair it reduces cross talk then as compared to the untwisted as compared to the coaxial all right a twisted pair cable whether it is your stp whether it is your utp see when we compare utp and stp stp is better than utp all right but when we compare twisted pair versus untwisted pair all right when we say twisted pair versus untwisted pair you know twisted pair will have what you know it will have it will basically reduce the electromagnetic radiation from the from the pair and cross talk between the neighboring pairs it will reduce the cross talk between the neighboring pairs and improves rejection of external electromagnetic interference anyways forget about it now just remember one thing from this part that the twisted pair reduces the cross talk as compared to the untwisted pair this is what the question next question is about all right basically they don't ask such type of question in exam although they have mentioned in your cisa qae but you know they generally do not ask such type of technical question in your exam because 
this kind of question is not checking your auditing skills anyways you know uh, we are having this question therefore we are discussing about it advantage of utp or stp over other copper based cables is what basically the question is trying to uh, ask about twisted versus non twisted advantage of utp or stp over other copper based cables is what the answer is reduces cross talk all right the other options are protection against the wire tapping no there is hardly any protection against the wire tapping in case of the utp or the stp all right see we will learn more about this wire tapping and all that in next domain domain number 5 but anyways uh point number b is not the correct option point number c is what long distance no in fact attenuation will happen attenuation will happen in case of the twisted pairs and thereby you know in in case if you are using the twisted pair you will need repeaters repeaters are required because of attenuation so basically it is not suitable for the long distance and point number b is also not the correct option the correct option is point number a it reduces the crosstalk let's look at the next question